everyone, welcome to my dining room, or as some of my friends know it as a showroom for my mini dining tables. It's an occupational hazard. It is, they, they change out quite frequently. So this is one of my favorite rooms in my home. It's what I consider my room. I make it pretty and decorate it how I want it and don't think about the kids or anybody else. Because so. they're not allowed to eat on the table. <laughs> That's all right. Only on special occasions. We'll just get started here. So one of the first pieces I built for this specific room when I changed was my giant, what do I call this? Sideboard. It's a sideboard. Sideboard. It's called a sideboard on our site too. We'll be linking to this. It's got all the storage, guys. It's like one of my favorite. Ash, you want to open the door I and love show? this. This is like outdoor gate hardware. Uh-huh. But she's used it for inside. And it's yep. got all the storage. So it holds all my... Um, and a straw. Yes. It holds, <laughs> there you go. When you have six kids, you find these sort of things. I have a love for white dishes and entertaining. And so it's just such a great place to store them. And it's massive. So yeah, that was one of the first pieces I built. And moving up, I've got my super cute sugar mold that I filled. This is from our producers and cameraman, Stephen and Lauren. And we filled them with cute little succulents from Michael's, which we love. So those were or so Were these fun. like a dollar? I think so, yeah, because I got them when they were like 60% off. So like, because everything's always on sale. Moving up, this is actually the second set of these because when I changed the color on my dining table, I kept the cleats on the wall, but changed out the shelf and added some hardware, also gate hardware or garage door hardware and they are the dining room floating shelves. So we'll put a link in the description box below that'll lead to the page on our website where we're linking to everything that you're gonna see in this yes. room. Yes, as many tchotchkes as we can too. And all the white stuff, isn't most of that from Home Goods? Yep. Home goods, like our favorite place to buy white dishes. Actually, even the Dollar Tree, if you're just needing standard white plates to decorate with, because a lot of times you'll need some added height, like I needed something a little bit taller here, so I just got some white Dollar Tree dishes, a buck each, and then stacked those up for some height. This cutie cutting board is from Target, and I love it because it's got the white wood and then the marble on the other side. I have the same one. Target has all the fun stuff. They do. Including my gift things, which... If I'm being honest, this is from Thanksgiving, um... Two years ago? Not two, well, no. Last it was year. last year. It was last year. It was last year. Ones. But I just, you always have a reason to be thankful, so I feel like it can stay up all year long. Okay, so moving on. You gonna talk about the table? Talking about the table. I built this one several months ago. I love, I'm actually gonna pull this chair out so y'all can get a good view of them legs. <laughs> They've got some really chunky bases, and I laminated two bys together to give you that really substantial, it's actually a two by six. Two by sixes that basically make a four by six, which is probably not even wood that you can buy. It made the table, table super inexpensive, but it gave it a really beefy, expensive feel. This is briar smoke stain that I did on the top, and I also did a coat of triple thick so that my kids, when they do use it, can't ruin it. Wipe it down. That's right. The benches go with it. I will say, I built these benches and then I did the plans because after I built them, I noticed the original plan was a little tippy. So when I made the plans, I did make the feet a little bit wider. So you're welcome for that. The chairs, they're like our favorite chairs. Let me show you right here. These are amazing. And They've they're got so a, big. They are, they're just big and comfy. Let me sit in it for you. Look how big it is, it's awesome. It's just a great, great chair. Modern yet really traditional at the same time. My table runner is World Market Find. Just found that a couple That's of cute. weeks ago. Thank you. I want one. So this whole setup is World Market, but the bowl that it's sitting in, our producers, thanks again, Steve-O and Lauren, brought these from the Nashville Flea Market. So they found those and brought them back to us and they're just, oh, they're so cute, I love them. Barcelona vases are from World Market. Uh -huh. The stems are also from World Market. Me and Whitney have these all over our house. Yes, and the number one question I get about my dining room is, where'd you get the light? And that is a Hinkley light that I just love. It's so pretty and one of the bulbs is out, so forgive me but it is called the Fulton 8 Light Chandelier. Again, we'll link to it. It's like one of my favorite pieces. I love how open it is and it gives it so much light. And it's big. It's, it's almost big. as big as your table. That's I love right. That. All right, moving on. The mirrors, also a huge project on our site. These actually started stained. I just framed out three standard grade cheap mirrors from Home Depot. Five dollar mirrors. Uh huh. And I stained them, but then I went back and painted them to match the new look. That tutorial's on our site. Super easy, great beginner project. We always like to hang like wreaths on mirrors like this. Just give it a little texture. Yeah, just 
makes it stick out from the wall a little bit. Yeah, moving on, we've got our wine holder with five bottles of wine on it. Good yes. job. I've, well, I've been pregnant, so. <laughs> and this is probably the third or fourth wine holder that we've made for our site. It's my favorite, though, I It think. is, I love it. And we've got a video for this. You can click right here and watch it. Download the free plans. And my curtains are Pottery Barn. I love to get those at Pottery Barn. They have great blackouts and they also make them long enough because I have really tall windows. The rug is from Wayfair. Wayfair. That's right, the rug's from Wayfair. And the flooring, I kind of blended the flooring that I have in my kitchen along with this stuff. So it's from Tile Shop and it's just a really pretty mm -hmm. travertine. The wall color is Antique White by Sharon Williams. So is the trim, right? Yes, so is the trim. Eventually, I'd love to go white right now. It's just cream, but it's, it's good. I like it. That's pretty much it, guys. That's my dining room. I hope you love it. We'll be linking to everything, like Ash said, in the post and below in the description. And we're out of here. So we'll see ya. It's dinner time. That's right. What are you eating? Uh, something good. <laughs>